Uh, greetings, we're outside in the garden and I'm just doing that uh, maintenance on the hustler antenna that we're talking about. So I've, uh, I've whipped the uh, top of the antenna off and we've got the, the base of the antenna which is uh, hammered into the ground, you can see it there. And then we've got the radials here which I've got a few attached, different uh, points. And then basically what I'm going to do is I'm just going to clean off some of this uh, build up of like white sort of it's a bit of oxidisation caused from the aluminium uh, and the, obviously there's moisture so I'm just going to scrape all that off give that a good clean up and uh, make sure that that's spotless because this is where the main connection point is <coughs> excuse me, where the Jubilee clip clips on it makes contact there so I'm going to make sure that's all cleaned up properly and then uh, I'll just show you the, the vertical one second this is uh, Fizzy by the way are you going to say hi there Fizz? what are you doing? <laughs> but anyway so the vertical is on the floor, I've uh, just been adjusting the length, there it is, it's, it's on the bottom there, so looking okay, in pretty good order for well, quite a few years old, 15 years old, so this is a trap situation, and uh, I've just adjusted all the, the clips, make sure they're tight, and that's the top resonator, so that's the situation there, and uh, what I'm going to be doing is just giving it a quick clean up, I'm making sure everything's in good order there, so yeah, this is just uh, keeping an eye on things for me. That's where the beam is down the bottom there, just have a quick look at it. There we are, but right now we're back on this one, so. And just uh, for anybody following me, the vertical VHF, one I've been putting the new antenna, the new radio for, that's just up there, that's the F23. So that's quite a big beast and there's a satellite array. So, back to this job in hand. I'm going to carry on cleaning up the uh, antenna system, get it all sparkling and then connect it back up and then I'll come back and just give you a quick picture of see what it looks like from M0 or YKS. Okay, yeah, <coughs> yep, I guess that's how it is. Well these guys said it's time to stop messing with the antenna and uh, go for a walk. Is that what you're wanting or is it dinner time? Either way, they're wanting my attention. So yeah, the situation is complete. And back up so we've just adjusted the the length of the 10 meter section I've actually cut a little bit off and I've shortened the uh, 20 meter section slightly because they were a little bit lower down the band resonant so I've got them for the DX areas and now I'm going to be looking at seeing how it performs on 40 meters because it was a little bit lower down more for the data portion so now I've adjusted it it should be better for what I'm after this is M0YKS with a six band trap vertical from Hustler. Yeah, so I've just adjusted the Hustler six band trap vertical. I ended up cutting off about uh, probably just over an inch off the bottom of the 10 meter section. So that's now uh, a lot better. It were resonant up uh, down at the CW portion of 10 meters. So I worked it out and I thought, well, I'll, sh I'll shorten the uh, element, make it around the, the SSB portion, which in turn will bring the other bands down by shortening that one. So now I'm uh, ended up with 15 meters resonant at the uh, SSB portion around uh, 21, 200 to, to 350, which is a lot better, 1.5 maximum SWR. And uh, 20 meters is one to one from about 14, 150 up to 14, 300. So I'm pretty pleased with that. And I can hear uh, W2RE booming in now in the contest. So that's on the vertical. Oh, sorry, it's the beam. That's the vertical. A couple of S points lighter than the beam, but yeah, that's can't complain. So, 40 meters, that's the reason why I adjusted the antenna. And uh, I'm very pleased because now I've got uh, resonance around the area that I want to operate from 7.100 up to 7.200. It's uh, 1.8 maximum SWI, which is a bit more reasonable, and I should be able to tune the, uh, the amplifier a little bit better. So down on, on 80 meters, uh, that's the, it, were, it was 7.50, it's now dropped a little bit to about 7.20 uh, low SWR reading. So yeah, I don't really use it for 80 much, it's good for listening, but uh, at the same time I could fiddle with that and get that a bit better. So yeah, that's the update with its, the Hustler six band trap vertical slightly shortened. Uh, I adjusted the uh, 15 element using the uh, Jubilee clip and I cut off one inch off the 10 meter element. So that's how we did it. Hope you have some fun and uh, if you need any advice for your six band trap verticals, just give us a shout and we'll see if we can help you out. 
this is M0YKS getting back to the contest. <laughs> 